In this video I'm going to show you how to install your Ryzen processor onto your motherboard socket. So what you do is you identify where the little triangle is. You can see it just there in the corner on your CPU and then you line that with the triangle in your socket. So first locate them. You might be able to just see it there, the little triangle there. And that shows you how to align them. Basically, usually it's going to be like lettering straight across, straight across towards the top of the socket. Yeah, so it's all going to so that's lettering there. And your horizon lettering will be across there. That's how it normally is. It should be like that. But do identify the little triangles. You can just see it here. Usually the triangles be a little bit larger. This one's tiny. And just make a little golden triangle there in the corner. And that shows you the orientation. So the first step is you complete the first step. Just to identify how it's going to go in, so it's going to pick it up and slot it straight down without any force. So that's the first step, just to identify the little triangle so you know exactly where it's going to go. The second step is to uh, loosen the retention arm, bring it up, and as you bring it up, the socket will move slightly that way. So now you're ready to slot in your CPU. Pick it up, try not to touch the top and definitely do not touch the pins. Hmm? Don't touch these pins. Just hold it from the side and just place it over your socket. See I'm lining it up. I yeah, can't really see. And it should just slot in. Yeah, slotted in without any force, lined up, try not to touch the top, and we're good to go. Right, putting the retention arm back down so that it can hold the CPU in, and then we can move on to the next stage. So there we go, just put the lever arm down there. Lock it in place, and that's it. That's how you install your Ryzen CPU. You can even pick it up. I won't try. See, so it's basically step one is to identify the little triangle. It's very tiny in this one, usually, they'll be bigger. Step two is to identify the triangle on your board. Normally, the lettering across should be the same as on the top of the socket yeah should be all neat and tidy straight across undo the retention arm just place it over the socket you don't use much force let it slot in and you shouldn't have any force let it slot in and then pull the retention arm down and then you're done that's how you install your CPU into your motherboard, your Ryzen processor. This is a 5600X. Yeah, system is on. And that should come on if everything is good to go. Oh, there we go. 36 degrees and it's cooling down quick. There you go, the fans are on. GPU and CPU, and yeah, the temperatures drop fairly quickly. It's 26 degrees idle, it's got no operating system, anything plugged in. Just the main components on this motherboard memory, CPU, and GPU.